to my beloved. What a journey we have been on. What a path we have walked. Of course you are beautiful, but you are so much more than that. You are unconditionally kind, undyingly faithful, and unstoppably passionate. You are someone the world looks to, and they can see God's glory in your smile. And you guys may think that the Rachel and Tyler love story began in high school, but actually you'd be wrong. <laughs> it really began over a decade ago on one of those fateful beach trips when Rachel locked herself in a bathroom crying all because someone accused her of liking Tyler. <laughs> And again, I probably just thought the whole thing was hilarious. Little did I know, there must have been some truth to that accusation. She liked him then, and she still obviously likes him now. We met in preschool, so we just grew up together, went to high school together, and we've just kind of stuck together all our lives. The summer of my sophomore to junior year, we started hanging out a lot more. We took this trip to Disney World, like as a field trip. We spent a lot of time together and kind of fell in love at Disney World. Did you grab socks out of here? So Tyler wasn't with us for very long when we found out we had a pretty special guy in our lives. Tyler's just hanging out in his stroller, watching people come and go as they will, and a lady passed out nearby. Tyler, without a word, gets up out of his stroller, grabs a water bottle, marches straight over to the lady with all of the paramedic skills that a two-year-old can muster. But I mean, he had it, he had it covered. She was just supposed to be, be better. And that compassion has been with him his entire life, and it is today. And Tyler, I stand in front of you today, the proudest a dad could be. Your mom and I know that we've given what we could, and it's been both a joy and a privilege to be your parents. And we want you to know we love you very much. You look so handsome. I love you. You look gorgeous. You look great. Thank you. Is it like, I like this up here, though, but it's not like it's... Um... I'm a terrible father. Rachel, I don't know how it happened, but at some point you went from that little sister a year and a half behind me to this driven and responsible woman that I look up to. But you always conducted yourself like a lady always with integrity, always with character. While all the little boys were around Rachel Taylor, you acted like a wonderful, virtuous young woman. And it moved me to know that. Rachel, she made parenting easy. You've made an incredible decision in the young man that you've chosen as your husband. And I support you in that, and I love you, and I'm extremely proud of you. This is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> love you. into an accident when he was playing basketball about two months into our relationship and almost died. So I was in the hospital for like 10 days and she was there with me through it all. Probably one of the roughest physical things that I've been through uh, and she was super supportive and just there for me. Yeah, that's definitely how I knew um, that he was the one for me. I see that as kind of the point where I was like, this is, this is my wife. I mean, we're finally here. It's an honor for me to prepare to be your wife. <laughs> and 
I love you. It excites me to know that God is joining together a virtuous man, a virtuous woman today to build a kingdom marriage that will be a blessing to God's kingdom from now on. Lord, we're thankful today for Tyler. We're thankful for Rachel. We're thankful that they stand here today. Lord, it's such a joy for Pastor Ron and I to stand in agreement with these parents today as we declare and ask your blessing over every word that's spoken, the song that's sung, the rings that are exchanged, Father, the vows that are made one to another. In Jesus' name, amen. <laughs> I talked to my parents about proposing, and then my sister, who's like the greatest planner of all time, is like, why don't we just build her a gazebo? I was like, uh, okay. <laughs> He made it a surprise. I was blindfolded and he set up, it looked like hundreds of candles on all these tree stems. He had hung up all these pictures of us, like from preschool and kindergarten graduation, like ones where we're all together. And then the last picture was flipped and it was me on my knee with the ring and she flipped it over and then she went and looked at me and I was on my knee proposing. So it was really awesome. It was so sweet. Like he put so much effort into it and it was beautiful. In Tyler, you're getting the best part of the Hanson family. I know from personal experience, he'll love you like no other person, stand by you when everything else is falling down. I know that they don't really ask siblings if they're willing to give away their brother or sister on their wedding day, but today I stand here willing to give you my person. And I also want to charge you with something. Go and make a life. Live a life worthy of the sacrifice and the redemption that Jesus paid on the cross. I vow to continually love you in specific, intentional, and ever fresh ways. I promise to never stop learning about you. I vow to support your dreams and to dream with you. Your struggles are my struggles and your victories are my victories. to dream wild dreams with you and encourage you to always keep your gaze fixed on Christ regardless of our circumstances. I vow to be a safe harbor for you to come to anytime. I vow to love you from this day until the end of my days. I will pray for you and with you. Tyler Allen Hansen, today it is an honor to finally become your wife. I'm gonna let you guys turn and face me and we're gonna let everybody else here take a really deep breath. I pronounce that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. <laughs> Tyler, you can turn and kiss your wife. From this moment on, all of me belongs to you. My eyes are yours, my mind is yours, but most of all, my heart is yours. You are my prayer partner, my best friend, and my cheerleader. And from this day forward, you are my wife. The one I will love from this day to the end of my days. Tyler, your husband. That's hard, man. There's a lot of things to like about Rachel. A lot of noise for a dress. Oh, oh my God! That is an actual thing. 
fucked your baby. You're gonna kiss in a second, so I wanna do my part. Thank you. So you excited about today? Yeah, <laughs> that's an understatement, man. <laughs> that's an understatement. So I'm very excited. <laughs>